Well, I want to play off Lenore's comment because it kind of makes you think that the Tina trade is dead and if not dead, at least potentially heading towards life support. Tina being there is no alternative. So fixed income investors who are forced to buy as a proxy stocks that would pay high dividends, whether that be REITs or telecom or utilities. And if you think about this, the source of the treasury market as a, as a secure way of actually making some income, you know, you start to, to think differently about, um, about the fixed income market.